In this video, we'll be focusing on the 11 fundamental problem from chapter 1. We are asked to determine the average normal stress at point A, B, and C. The diameter of each segment is given below. For segment A, we have 0.5 inch diameter. Segment B, we have 1 inch diameter. And segment C, we have 0.5 inch diameter. To calculate the average normal stress, the equation is given by sigma average equals P, your force, divided by A, your area. For a circular cross section, the area is equal to pi over 4 times your diameter squared. At section A, we see a force of 3 kip. At section FB, we can calculate the force using the left or the right hand side. In this case, we're going to use the left, which is 9 kip minus 3 kip equals 6 kip. If you use the right hand side, you will get negative 6 kip, which is also correct. Now we calculate for the force at C, which is simply 2 kip. Now let's calculate the average stresses at each section. Section A is equal to sigma average equals your force, 3 kip, divided by pi over 4 times your diameter squared. This gives us 15.3 KSI. And the force is in tension. This is the answer for section A. Now let us consider section B. The average stress at section B is equal to 6 kip divided by your area which is pi over 4 times 1 inch squared which is equal to 7.64 KSI and this force is in compression this is your answer for section B now let's consider section C The average stress at section C is 2 kip divided by your area, which is pi over 4 times your diameter, which is 0 0.5 squared. And this is equal to 10.2 KSI. This force is in tension. And this will be your answer for section C. If you found this solution helpful, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe.